What's up guys? Currently five weeks out from the Olympia. Currently feeling very lazy. So got a TBT video today. Throwing it back to Vancouver when I was down there about a month ago. Got some training at West Coast Iron, mostly competing at the Van Pro Show and just kind of chilling, hanging out around there. Got Calvin on the edits too, so none of my crappy edits. And a part two coming up as well. So if you guys like it, please like and subscribe and take it back to Vancouver. That's the new dog magic trick, right? Yeah, are we starting it in here? Yeah. Hi, my name's Lacey. I'm 18 years old. Um... <laughs> <clears throat> What's up, YouTube? We are here in beautiful Vancouver, or Coquitlam. I'm not sure if it's still Vancouver, but we're close. We are here for the Vancouver Pro Show. Just flew in approximately five hours ago, and Calvin finally found me. And here we are in the first YouTube video of the day. So literally just flew in, got my meals. Huge shout out to Training Day Cafe. Literally sent them, I don't normally do this, I'm not normally this big of a diva, but it's the Olympia prep, so we're doing it. But I sent them everything I gotta eat, grams of rice, chicken, salmon, ground turkey, everything, and they got it all in there, so I don't need to weigh anything or make any food this whole weekend, which is a lifesaver. So we just picked that up. Calvin actually picked that up for me. Came back, ate a meal real quick, because I've only eaten like twice a day, and now we're gonna train. So came down here with Melissa and Ian, but they're staying at a hotel down the road, because he wanted to have a full kitchen, and I went with the cheap Airbnb. But it's pretty cute in here, so I like it, it's cute. But yeah, so here for Melissa and Ian, they're competing on Saturday. Amateur show is Friday. Probably gonna watch some of the amateurs and a lot of the pros. Because I'm that weird guy in the crowd. I'm that guy in the back of the crowd by himself who's just like, that's an excellent bikini competitor. But yeah, so that's it. Here we are in Vancouver. We're heading to the gym, West Coast Iron. It's a pretty cool hardcore gym. They just opened up like under a year ago, I think. It's all opened up because the weather's nice. They got like garage doors open and all that. Hot as hell, so. Stay hydrated, kids. Should I turn that on? Is that, is that rude? <laughs> oh Do we close the blinds? We're gonna get pizza pre workout He's getting pizza. And then I gotta sit in the car and watch him eat. <laughs> new me. This is a new C bomb being on a diet. I feel like I haven't I haven't done any YouTube being on a diet. Prep brain. <laughs> Prep brain. I've been prepping for four days. I can't even walk straight. Oh my god, I'm so tired. I'm so hungry. I have so many cravings. <laughs> okay. You're at West Coast Iron, Mecca of the West Coast. I don't know my geography. I also got called out in my last video because I tell people I always start back day with pull down and I didn't do it. So,
people here. set a workout at the beginning and then you don't have to try for the rest of your workout and you're good to go home secret Naturally, naturally, we'll do some rack pulls. This is lower than my normal standard. I normally rack pull right at my knee, like right below my knee, but this rack doesn't adjust, so. I guess we're not going heavy today. Making do with what we got. It took me to like four or five weeks out to get on the last loop, last loop. Eleven weeks out, last loop of the belt. Waist is shrinking, and they say that rack pulls the deadlifts make your waist bigger. Mine's shrinking. better you feel in these hot gyms. I feel like working on like a cold air conditioned gym, you need to warm up every every new exercise you do, you feel like you need to warm up. So when you're sweating like this, it just feels better. I also need to say this out loud because I know I'm gonna get chirped. My shoe sock combo right now. I get called it every time. It's not my fault. I left my luggage at my sister's hotel. I was wearing my Adidas foot. I wearing my Adidas foot flops earlier, and I brought my Nike shoes. So I apologize in advance for brand mismatching.
That's it. Be a true good cameraman would unwrap the weights for me while I sit down and catch my breath. Okay, let's find a machine. bottom, like a little rest at the bottom, let it stretch, you just roll back, pull your chest up as tight as possible, really get those like rhomboid upper trap work, that okay. nice back. Don't go back now. video I have to have an excuse. This one, my excuse for a shitty back, directed at you, Brian, that I have no machines at my good life I train at. If I train at a gym like this every week, my back would just be like just like Brian, for sure, right?
this fucking muggy weather right now is so hot and humid. I to, I'm gonna have to literally go shopping because if I have like, first of all, I sweat when I have an awkward conversation. So if it's hot, muggy, and I'm having an awkward conversation, wearing a gray shirt, I'm gonna be drenched in sweat tomorrow. So we need to go shopping tonight. the end of our back workout. Surprisingly, I actually had a really good workout considering it was a travel day. But it was only like a one flight, so I can't complain. But atmosphere in this gym is pretty lit, so good workout. That's the end of today. I'm gonna grab a shake here, my post-workout. He has me having like 30 grams of carb, like a carb powder, and 50 grams of isolate, so my post-workout right now. I'm gonna get that made here, and then we're gonna go home and we're gonna fucking party. <laughs> 